Alistair Crawl, Lean Analytics, Use Data to Build a Better Startup Faster. Are you dreaming of building a startup? Then Aline Analytics, Use Data to Build a Better Startup Faster, by Alistair Crawl is the ultimate guide to unlock your startup's potential. This book emphasizes the importance of data and analytics in building a sustainable and successful business model. You'll discover the significance of metrics, different stages of startup development, and ways to define your business model. This summary covers vital topics like data-informed decision-making, product market fit, and leveraging your unique advantage in a competitive market. The book is a treasure trove of insights to help transform your startup dreams into a well-oiled, thriving organization. The importance of data in startups. As an entrepreneur starting a new business, data is vital to the success of your organization. It allows you to soberly measure your success and keep you on track towards your goal. Data is the antidote to self-delusion and is the ultimate tool that will guide you along your journey. However, you should not become a robot that just follows the numbers, but instead stay data-informed. Collecting and analyzing data can become addictive, and using it to optimize just one part of your business might undermine its overall image or integrity. Therefore, as an entrepreneur, you need to stay grounded in reality and remember that data is just another tool in your toolbox. Effective Metrics for Data-Informed Decisions To make data-informed decisions, find good and understandable metrics that are comparable and effective as ratios. Making data-informed decisions requires finding effective metrics that provide relevant and meaningful data. The primary goal is to make decisions that guide you to the right product and market before running out of money. To measure success, good metrics should have three essential qualities. First, they should be comparable and reveal how things are developing over time. For example, increased revenue from last week provides more meaningful information than just 2% revenue. Second, your data should be easily understandable, keeping you moving in the right direction. If nobody can comprehend or remember your data, it will turn into a burden and won't lead to positive changes in your organization. Finally, the most useful metrics are those that are effective as ratios. Ratios are easier to act on, allowing you to compare short-term metrics over a longer period. For instance, ad clicks per day over the average clicks within a month, tells you if your site is more popular at a certain time or if viewers are starting to taper off. When it comes to finding good metrics, simplicity is key, so focus on straightforward and understandable metrics like revenue per week. Finding your place in the business world. Building a thriving startup is not just about creating a product that works, it's about finding a perfect intersection between demand for your product and your passion. This means identifying a business you genuinely care about and can earn money from, identifying a real need in the market, and making sure you can satisfy that need better than your competitors. Additionally, the importance of building a competitive advantage through a network of friends and contacts cannot be overstated. Founders need to show their enthusiasm for solving a specific problem to attract investors. Finally, it's critical not to waste time and money building something nobody wants. The Five Stages of Startup Development As per the Lean Analytics Framework, startups go through five stages of development, empathy, stickiness, virality, revenue, and scale. In the empathy stage, entrepreneurs identify a need that the market has, which points them in the right direction for their niche. In the stickiness stage, they figure out an effective way to answer that need in a way customers are willing to pay for. In the virality stage, they build the product, features, and functionality to attract customers. Once there is a base of loyal customers, they move to the revenue stage, where the business expands rapidly. Finally, in the scale stage, they aim to break into new markets or expand their operations. The stages of stickiness, virality, and revenue contribute to a startup's growth. Stickiness ensures customer retention, assessed by measuring engagement, while virality measures the number of new users each established user brings in. Revenue is the ultimate metric for identifying a sustainable business model. 
Facebook's success, for instance, largely stems from its strategy of generating revenue through highly personalized ads on users' pages. Stay focused on one metric. In the startup world, success depends on staying focused. Instead of drowning yourself in data, concentrate on the most critical metric for the stage you're in. This one metric that matters, OMTM, helps you set clear goals and measure your success. Your OMTM should be simple, immediate, actionable, and comparable for easy tracking, comparing, and adapting. For instance, in the restaurant industry, the staff cost to gross revenue ratio is an ideal OMTM. By setting a clear goal of a 0.25 ratio, you can analyze your customer's balance between service and profitability and adjust your costs accordingly. Avoid stressing over irrelevant numbers and concentrate on the right thing at the right time. Knowing your OMTM helps you keep track of what's important and helps you present your company's history to an investor. It's the key to achieving success in the startup world. Essential Elements of a Successful Business Model A good business model is vital for any startup, and it must be based on the core concepts of the business. Business models are a mix of various aspects such as sales tactics, product types, revenue sources, and delivery models. When creating a business model, a founder must consider all these elements carefully. Additionally, a good business model helps to distinguish valuable customers from those that may harm the business. Not all users are good for a startup, and a founder must prioritize and meet the needs of the most important customers to ensure the success of the business. E-commerce and customer acquisition E-commerce companies are very common in today's world and focus on loyalty or acquisition. Loyalty-focused companies like Amazon offer a wide range of products, while acquisition-focused businesses like secondhand car sales websites focus on one-time big sales. The most important metric for e-commerce is revenue per customer, which combines conversion rate and shopping cart size. It helps companies understand if they should prioritize customer loyalty or acquisition. Monetizing media sites Advertising plays a crucial role in generating revenue for media sites like Google's search engine and CNN's website. Online content providers rely heavily on ad-based monetization to pay the bills, offset operating expenses or subsidize products. The revenue from ads can be generated through displaying banners, sponsorship agreements, or affiliate relationships. For media sites, click-through rates, CTR, and display rates are vital to determine the real income. Nevertheless, ensuring visitors spend more time on the site, visit multiple pages, and have a high return rate is equally crucial. Tailoring the ads to match these figures is important. In summary, Media sites' business model centers on earning from advertising, which makes the click-through rates, the retention, and the generation of revenue from ads a priority. To wrap up, Lean Analytics teaches the essential techniques to build a successful startup by leveraging the power of data and analytics. It helps you in identifying an idea you're passionate about, finding the right market, and measuring your success through actionable and understandable metrics. Good metrics and data-informed decision-making will keep your startup growing through the various stages of development, empathy, stickiness, virality, revenue, and scale. Alongside, it emphasizes defining your business model and prioritizing customer needs to drive revenue and growth. In a nutshell, this book is a valuable resource for every aspiring entrepreneur who's ready to pave their path to success with data-driven insights.